Hi, my name is Laura and I provide operational support to the team at One Contemporary in Zug, Switzerland. Today, I would like to talk to you about Bombs by Ai Weiwei, which is also one of the most interesting new entries here at One Contemporaries. So, without further ado, let me guide you through. As you might already know, Ai Weiwei is among the most prominent Chinese living artists a multidisciplinary artist whose art engages in social and political discussions while presenting these themes within different chronological contexts. His production encompasses a range of different media. Beginning with painting, he later explored the medium of sculpture, photography, writing on his website, and even expanded to include architecture, public art, and performances. Despite the various media of production, Ai's art always addresses themes of social, political and ethical urgency and investigates our existence in relation to the many forces that surround us in this globalized economical structure. BOMBS is a large offset lithograph in black and white created in 2019, an edition of 500 featuring 50 renderings of both conventional weapons and weapons of mass destruction. Each weapon is titled, dated, scaled, and they are meticulously arranged one next to the other. Bombs was initially created as a monumental installation for Ice exhibition Bear Life, which took place at the Mildred Lake Kemper Art Museum on the campus of the University of St. Louis opening in September 2019 and closed in January this year. It was an imposing wallpaper, around 65 feet long and 36 feet high, that displayed the full-scale renderings of 43 weapons, including missiles and aerial bombs, developed by the US, Germany, Russia, Italy, the UK and Israel. Once again, the artist is pushing our attention towards one of his signature themes, the banality of evil, to say that in the words of the American-German philosopher Anna Arendt. I, as once stated, so human society designs bombs for their usage. They have a super technical function, but it shows deeply about our society, who we are. I sometimes am extremely serious, but at the same time, I'm laughing about it. I have to function both ways, otherwise you're not going to survive. Clearly, the aim behind bombs is to create awareness around the current critical global conditions, starting from political conflicts and exploitation of wars. I is continuing working with the idea of bombs as it's been commissioned by the Imperial War Museum in London to create a site-specific work titled History of Bombs, which will carpet the floor of the museum with hundreds of square feet of material decorated with bombs, coming later this year. <music>